show no love. Love will get you killed. Fuck your feelings, but fuck your feelings, nigga. Fuck your feelings, fuck your feelings, nigga. Fuck your feelings, nigga. Fuck your feelings. Yo, what's good, YouTube? This is Rob Dollar, and I'm back. Sick as fuck, but. I was like, yo, I gotta make this video to let you guys know that, of course, I'm back and address a lot of stuff that been going on. As you guys know, recently I got flagged. Now, before I get into this story and tell you guys what's going on, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and make sure if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe, hit that like button, and let's get into what's going on. Recently, October 13th, I was shut down by the haters because there's no there's no justifying why i was shut down you know what i'm saying there's no explanation for the reason why i was shut down you know what i'm saying why i was indicted i call it indictment because basically you took time out of your day to type up a whole statement of why my channel was wrong and why i should be shut down i wasn't even gonna fight for my channel i wasn't gonna fight at all like man look especially when it comes to the point where the people that are shutting you down are your own people like the people you chop it up with the people that smile in your face you know what i'm saying so it was like i didn't want to do it i was like well if i gotta it's cool to worry about people that just stumble upon your channel and then they want to shut you down that's fine i could deal with something like that but when it comes to the point where it's your own people that shutting you down then it's like why even waste my time doing this you know what i'm saying i was like man fuck it it is what it is db town tony d they reached out to me a couple of more people reached out i was like nah i don't give up your channel we're gonna fight for you and um now i'm back i got my channel back but uh still gonna be doing my review still gonna be talking to you guys Still gonna be Rob Dollar, you know what I'm saying? Giving you guys the truth of whatever you guys want to know. To my younger people, man, this is what I gotta tell you right now. To the younger viewers, I got children, so education. Let education be your hustle. Don't go to the street and try to sell drugs just to try to compete to get shoes. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you guys get education, a great career, and then you can get whatever you want to get. You know, as you guys can see, you can never relate the streets to youtube you can never relate streets to social media in my opinion because in the streets there's real life stuff happening there's people out there getting killed there's people out there getting locked up there's people out there getting indicted there's people out there ratting you can never relate the two you can in my opinion you can't do that i hope you guys learned a lesson because if there's people that actually take their time and type up a statement of why you doing why your channel should be shut down and what you're doing wrong even if it's lie or if it's true, if people can actually take their time out of their day to do all of that, imagine what they'll do in real life. That's why, like I said, make education your hustle. Forget the streets, forget all of that. Get your education, get a career. To get these when you got a career, education, and all your bills is paid, it'll be no problem. You know what I'm saying? Never allow shoes to dictate who you are as a person. You understand what I'm saying? It's just shoes, rubber. Plastic, suede, glue, like never allow a shoe to dictate who you are as a person. Stay away from the streets, stay away from the crabs, stay focused, make education your hustle. That's it. Don't do nothing else. Prime example, like I said, YouTube. If people could actually take time out of your out of their day to hate on you and give a statement to YouTube of why you did wrong or what you doing wrong on your channel, what they feel you doing wrong on your channel, or even lie and indict you on YouTube. Imagine what they're doing real life if they hating. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, I simply got shut down off of straight hate. It's no, it, there's no justifying, there's no explanation. I did nothing wrong on my channel. So why would a person take time out of their day just to shut me down? You see what I'm saying? You, you guys get my picture, and this is mostly to the younger audience because I'm pretty sure the older people understand what's going on. The younger audience don't really understand it. And to, this is not a competition thing. This is simply grown men with a hobby on YouTube showing what they picking up. You feel me? And there's people that actually envy that. There's people that actually hate that. You understand what I'm saying? So for them to take time out of their day... Just to write up statements of what you're doing wrong on your channel. If they have that time to do all of that on a social networking site, imagine what people would do in real life to you as a person. You understand what I'm saying? That's why I always tell my young audience, stay in school, get your education, make education your hustle. That's the most important hustle in your life. Education leads to career, leads to a better life. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm back. We're going to keep it pushing. F the haters and uh, let's get it popping. All right, y'all? This is Rob Dollar. Like, comment, and subscribe, man. I'm out of here.